to my room i'm staying in a hotel for one night only um i wanted to come to houston a day earlier than my actual move-in date i'm moving in tomorrow october 1st first day of the month fresh start all that good stuff but um i wanted to come to houston a day early so i could do some little errand things and also too because the leasing office doesn't open until the afternoon time and i want to Go, be able to have access to my apartment like as soon as the keys are available so i'm going to my apartment today around four ish to you know pay the check all that stuff and um get the keys but the keys are like a fob and it's digital on the app of my phone so i'll be able to access the apartment like at eight or nine o'clock in the morning so just got to my hotel I am super grateful that they were able to check me in early and they gave me an upgrade because your girl is titanium, okay? So let's look at the room. When I first came in, I, I thought like this was just it, but I love this little area right here. I could put my suitcases over there, have a little desk, little mirror action right here. I like this overhead lighting. And then this is a closet, which I will not be utilizing because baby, we ain't gonna be here that damn long. The bed, microwave, which is cool. Most hotels don't ever have microwaves. Big TV, nice comfy bed. My view is trash, but whatever. And then, look at this. Look at the bathroom. Oh wait, little bench area. And then come in here, my makeup is about to be popping tonight. We got double sinks, a shower bathtub, stand-up shower, and the privacy of the royal throne back there. So, we're here. I'm super excited to be here. I'm about to shower and get this makeup off my face from last night. Like, it's crazy that my makeup is still on. Like, lip liner and all. I still look like a glam doll so yeah hey everyone i'm back it's been a few hours y'all i had to get i had to get that nap in because your girl was dead okay i was so tired but i am about to go out or i'm about to get ready to go out um with some friends we about to do a little, a little turn up or whatever. It, y'all can't even see me. Okay. So I'm about to go out, about to get ready, about to get cute, about to beat this face, how I beat it yesterday, down. I'm trying to find my edge control brush because baby, your girl just has stuff everywhere. But, um, yeah, I am having like the worst difficulties 
with this freaking sew-in of mine and I thought I was fixing something and I actually made it worse so yeah oh god that didn't fix it either Mia 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 I had like a loose track then I got these lumpy ass tracks in the front my hair is just a fucking mess right now, but I gotta get this sewn out and I need to get my hair done properly because I'm gonna make it work for today, but after today, like, no one's gonna see me because I need to be focused on my apartment. So today, I went to Mattress Firm to go see if they had like, I wanted to really like test out some mattresses that I saw online, but they didn't have anything there. And um, on Facebook Marketplace, it's a bunch of people who sell like the, the good memory foam mattresses at like wholesale prices. So I contacted these one people because I wanted this Nectar bed frame. So they're gonna deliver that to me tomorrow. I'm super excited. I can just give them niggas cash on arrival. So that's exactly what I'll be doing tomorrow. Ooh. Right now, we're just trying to get the baby hairs laid right. Get them baby hairs laid right. And then I'm gonna do my makeup and then I'll come back around and then try to fix this wretched ass sewing. I'm too sexy for this chain, too sexy for your game, too sexy for this fame, yeah, yeah. I'm too sexy for the trap, too sexy for that cap, too sexy for that jack, yeah, yeah. Okay, alright, that's fine, okay, I'm feeling too sexy to accept requests, and I'm way too sexy to go unprotected, and she popped a Tesla, now she gone electric, okay, alright, that's fine, okay, think we got too sexy for that metro housing, Diamond popped out, almost swallowed 60,000. Section need more things in here, I like it crowded. Hey. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, I like it crowded. Oh, you like the boy? Well, tell me what you like about her. You a turnt a little thotty, ain't no wife about it. I'ma fuck her friends and send her back to Metro Housing. Yeah. Oh, wow. I'm too sexy for this sir, too sexy for your girl, too sexy for this world, too sexy for the life, too sexy for that jack, yeah, yeah. I'm too sexy for this chain, too sexy for your game, too sexy for this fame, yeah, yeah. I'm too sexy for the trap, too sexy for that cap, too sexy for that jack, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I pop out, get ghosts on the bitch, you don't know where I went Welcome. Pay for all my dogs, all my niggas behind the fence yeah. Drippin' in it, I was feelin' in it, new designer gear by Coaster Pay attention to the detail, going two-tone on choker Young niggas always ready to merc, some call them some smokers Young niggas have emotion, you don't make sure the car gets Hit a 360, win me when I left the scene That's that action, her best work on her knees too sexy for this cash, too sexy for this syrup, too sexy for these pills, I'm too sexy for this. I get cash, rub, I fly, got bitches sexing on me. Money cars and all the jewelry make a bit of sexy. I get cash, rub, I fly, got bitches sexing on me. Yeah. Oh, oh, wow. I'm too sexy for this sir, too sexy for your girl, too sexy for this world, too sexy for this eye, too sexy for that jack, yeah, yeah. I'm too sexy for this chain, too sexy for your game, too sexy for this. All right, final look. Had to fix the lips. The lips was looking too crusty. But we're good now. Little fashion of a dress. Super cute. I look amazing. Time to call over. First night in Houston. Girls in my crib, zero Snapchat, zero Instagram, boo, sing. Fuck up the vibe, my dick, start falling like London Bridge. I don't care if I saw you in a magazine or if you're on TV, that will not be nothing to me. Don't need a shot, oh baby, I need a freak. Lick it like ice cream, as if you're into me. It's nothing, it's nothing. No. Just like a knife, one side I lie, there's no stopping up, no shopping up, fuck that
which is like, I'm trying to cry, I want to cry, but I just can't believe that I'm here in this 800 square foot apartment that is literally mine. Like, this is mine, you know? <sighs> so, your girl is just happy to be here, okay? to be here. <laughs> so happy to be here. All right, time to get unpacking. Um, Some of my boxes are already here. Um, I, they, of course, they knew I was moving in today, so they had my two Amazon packages here waiting for me. My bed got here last week. I have someone from Task Rabbit coming to put the bed together. So super excited this bed was pricey but it's definitely going to be worth it Oh, I see you coming. Got my heart 
jumping like Jordan, play me like Sparta, move off of me. take a picture I had to put my name on a piece of paper and put the date and then take a picture of the broken item but this was one of the lids look at that crazy completely shattered but this is all of the stuff we do have so it comes with three different size lids and I have everything in the dishwasher right now so Yep, so I'm about to go to the store in a little bit, washing all of my glasses. So out of everything that I brought from Atlanta, I had one item that broke. It was one of the champagne flutes. That's fine. Um, what else? So my mattress came and the box spring. The box spring is too fucking big. It is too high because the mattress also sits up really, really high. And actually my mattress is backwards. So I'm trying to see if I can you know, maybe exchange it or get another one desperately. My new hangers are so freaking cute. I got black with the matte black top. I ordered 120 of these, I think. There's 60, yeah, 60 plus 60, I ordered 120, so yeah. All right, I'm closing my shears. Need a little bit of privacy now, cool. So I took all the boxes out of the living room, even the big ass box for the bed. The people that delivered my nectar mattress, the box spring is too big. I got a nine inch box spring when I really need one that is like four, that's like four inches or whatever. So hopefully that will 
work and suffice. Um, yeah, my bed is super pretty. It's from Meridian Furniture. I absolutely love her. Um, yeah. But I'm about to go to Target and get a shit ton of stuff. I have a list and then I'm going to go to HEB, see what this grocery store is hitting on. And then they'll be back to exchange my box spring. So we're going together. That's what I want. such a hard decision like what do I get fitted sheet. so wait what the fuck did I oh I got a sheet set
much stuff I have on my list that I have to get, which is crazy. Alright, just left Target. I spent $500. I had a gift card, so I really spent like $450 because I got sheets and all this stuff, but we're about to clean up. Um, the people are actually about to be here with the right size box spring for me now, so I'm about to run back downstairs to do that and yeah, wash the sheets. I got stuff to wash my clothes, so yeah your girl is making progress for day one my feet hurt and then these niggas trying to go to nomad later so we'll see i'm back so yeah just got back from target i was gonna go to the grocery store i still might they close at 11 but um target had a sale 20 percent off all bedding so i finally got my hands on some casaluna sheets i got the casaluna temperature balancing sheet set and of course i'll tag all this good stuff in the description box so i've heard great things about it and my good friend brianna shout out to her got me a hundred dollar gift card to help cover this high ass target balance today okay <laughs> then I got the Casa Luna Heavyweight Linen Blend Duvet Cover Set. I am so excited. So I'm actually about to wash my sheets because I need to, um, you know, put all this stuff on my bed tonight. And I also got a mattress cover. I got two pillows from Amazon too. Um, I want to see how I like them before I, damn, before I um buy two more. Like, why would this be tied like this? Like, the hook? I cut something. I saw it. That was the fitted sheet. Damn it, Mia. definitely soft definitely given soft and luxurious mm -hmm. yes ma'am okay what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go back to Target and buy another one and then I'm just gonna take my black sheets and swap it out. Swap it out, baby. Swap it out. Okay. I also want to wash my duvet cover. I got this too from Amazon, the hotel collection duvet cover. I mean, this is the duvet insert. It's a king to give it that plump 
that plumpness. So we are going to wash her too. I don't know if I can do everything. I don't think I'm gonna have room to wash this one as well. So we'll do that one in a second little shebang. But I'm very excited for these sheets. Okay. My mom bought me a shark off of Amazon, which I'm super excited about. So I'm going to have that actually in the mail tomorrow. I was gonna do like a deep clean of my place tonight, but I think I'm just gonna clean out the refrigerator so I can go get a few little groceries. But um, just some tampons. These are my absolute most favorite house shoes, house slippers. My feet hurt so bad, so I'm about to put these on right now. It's like, why do they make stuff so complicated? It's like you put this stupid ass tag on the inside of the shoe. I don't want to cut the fur, but y'all, my feet hurt so bad. I'm putting these on right now. I have some glass on the floor, so. Oh, this feels so good on my feet. I wish I had my box of shoes here so I could put my Uggs on. Yes, feet. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Some other things I got. It is a two-in-one, a strainer plus a stopper from this brand OXO. Um... Because I don't have silverware right now, I need to buy all that stuff. I'm really indecisive on what I want. Just, you know, a little plasticware. Trash bags, force flux, you gotta have these. Oh yeah, I got this little dustpan because I need to um, get this glass off the floor. Cascade to wash the dishes. I need to actually run the dishwasher because I have glasses in there right now that need to be washed. You know, some little wipes. Keep that booty clean. Keep that booty clean. I got two cotton swab thingies. I've never tried these before, but I actually am excited to try these. These are like the little in wash boosters. I heard that this was the absolute best glass cleaner. So we gonna see. Now this for real is the best stuff to wash your dishes with, no cap. My favorite mouthwash from Therabreath. Some more retinol, Olay, nighttime body wash. My favorite Tree Hut products. I get the scrub and the shave oil. And then of course, some Lysol. We got to clean out this refrigerator bra. Okay, I had to switch my memory card because we ran out of storage. <laughs> Last thing, Tide Oxy. This right here is the shit. I'm actually about to go do a load in a second. So actually, let me pause this real quick so I can go start the dish, start the laundry. This is pretty cool. I love the digital screen. Very nice and quiet. Okay, Whirlpool, I see you. Doing your thing. Okay. I got some of this stuff too. It's like the jet dry or the cascade dishwashing 
like um it's like a, a rinse aid i want to add it to my dishwasher so so i brought stuff from atlanta with me like my glasses and then this came with the pots and pans so i just want to get everything nice and washed So the settings are right here at the top. Um, cycles. I love everything's digital. Let's do a normal. Heat it dry, high temperature wash, period. And just like that. Love that, nice and sleek. All right, so I want to mop. I think I'm going to mop tomorrow after the guy comes to set up my Wi-Fi. So I got the Cedar Easy Ring Rinse Clean Microfiber Spin Mop System. So we about to get to work with that tomorrow. Other items. Razors, these are my favorite razor, razors, Hydro Silk, Clorox wipes. I'm gonna use this to mop as well. It smells so good. It's like the unstoppable fresh smell. Some more micellar water to take off my makeup. Hand soap, my hands are freaking disgusting probably right now. Ciao, I thought I left the paper towels and the toilet paper in the Uber's car. Okay, I'm gonna try this out too. It's like this Mr. I mean Scrub Daddy Tangerine Cleaning Paste. It smells good, so then I got a Scrub Mommy. This is the best toilet bowl cleanser ever. It's like the Lysol two-in-one bowl and brush disinfection, disinfection. Here we go. Boom. I love this stuff. It gets your toilet good. There's a few things I need to get off of Amazon that I didn't get at Target, but Scrub Daddy, Dial Soap, some rubbing alcohol, Ultra Foaming. This is um, a bathroom cleaner. I'm about to use that in my shower. And then we got some Lysol disinfectant spray. And of course I got paper towels and toilet paper. So what I wanna do right now though is get this fucking glass off the floor. And then I am going to, um, and then I'm going to, um, I wanna clean out the refrigerator. So yeah, you guys can clean with me. I don't ignore you. You said it first, but I meant it more, girl. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. You got potential, I can't explain. You're so persuasive, I made some changes. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Where were you this whole time? Come and see me now, not another time. You should come and see me on the regular. I don't know if we'll find a better time Where were you this whole time? Come and see me now, not enough time You should come and see me on the regular I don't know if we'll find a better time Cause I've been sleeping with a pistol in my bed I'd rather have you here instead I gotta get out of my own Don't keep me waiting You love me how 
you love me, then just say it all Take me home. You came the closest. We should be closer. Oh, yeah. Oh, Sleeping with a pistol in my bed I'd rather have you here instead I gotta get out of my own head Don't let me down, come here right now Good morning It is my first day waking up in my new apartment I feel like an 85 year old woman. Oh, with back pains and all that. I need a massage so, so, so bad. Um, I'm up because the AT&T fiber technician should be here soon. Um, he's probably gonna call my phone any moment now. But yeah, y'all, I have so much to do and I'm just trying to, you know, pace myself and all that good stuff and excuse my dryer I am drying my um my down the down alternative duvet insert so we can get this bed poppington okay so yeah I need to put away dishes and all that good stuff. Let me grab my phone because I just feel like I don't want to be far from it when it rains. My room is dark because I got the blinds down. So yeah, I keep saying blinds. They're not blinds. They're shades. Okay, so update. Amazon had broke one of the lids. I'm oh, sorry. One of my lids came broke in my corrupt pants, pot pan set. I got an email this morning that said they just refunded me for the whole thing. That's fine, but um, I still want another <laughs> pot and pan set. The book. These are their utensils that came with the pots and pans. I want to order more of these. And I also want to find a home to put all of this stuff in. So right now, just, you know. But I decided that this cabinet up here, this is gonna be where I keep all of my cups and things. So, yeah, they all came in the mail. I mean, they all washed perfectly. Okay, so the lid that broke was my, the lid that broke was my, um, was the, the, the bigger one. So, yeah. I'm sad because I need, what is sticky right here? So this is what everything looks like with its respective lid. It's like this rubber around the, I love this, this is so cute. Okay. I need like a dish towel. Some of these still have water on them. Hmm. That is a little funky. All right, so let's start putting our faves away. These 
drawers are so deep, like they go back so far. nail and it hurts so bad. I wasn't trying to flick y'all off, my bad. <laughs> so, this is what I have so far. I guess that's okay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But I need to buy drinking glasses. I just want to find like some cute ones that I like. Then I want to put all of my specialty glasses at the top. Like wine glasses and all that good stuff. I need some microfiber cloths too. OCD is flaring. That's the at and guy. As a black woman, I try to make sure that I'm being safe, especially when you have service workers or technicians entering your home. Um, hold on. So it was an at and technician plus another guy, both black guys. But I was like, why the fuck do two people need to come? The, fr the second person, I guess, was like a salesperson or whatever. I was like, like, you really weren't needed at all. Then the technician was like, I need to run out to my truck real quick. And I just went in my closet just to make sure it was nothing fucking missing. I mean, it's really nothing in my apartment, but fucking still. Anyways, this is the progress I've made. Let me know if y'all like this. I just have so much more stuff to get. So these are just all my cups that I have so far. Um, one of these broke in the mail, but it's okay. And then I'm gonna get my drinking glasses, which will go here probably. So, yeah. And I'm about to wash these, put these in the dishwasher because I'm lazy. And I don't want to hand wash I don't have a dry rack, so yeah. I really want to find a replacement lid for this. It's like, it's cool they give me my money back, but a bitch still needs the lid. So I wonder if I can reach out to the manufacturer directly. Hey y'all, it's much later. It's like 4.45 p.m. I went back to sleep after the AT&T fiber people left. Um, I had to get my heating pad out because my back was hurting. But um, my mom ordered me a shark vacuum, like a stick vacuum from Amazon. It's here. 
it got sent to the leasing office instead of going to like a locker or whatever but I brought some box that but i'm about to eat my leftovers i got last night from this after hour spot called bellies bellies is so good it's a um like a, a nigerian spot but their food is so freaking good it's the brussels sprouts for me I still haven't been grocery shopping because I just feel like grocery shopping is going to take a lot out of me. And I just don't have that to give right now. I need to order bar stools. Mm. That's like the first thing that needs to happen. The bar stools, baby. So, yeah. Mm, 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 mm. It don't make no sense how good this food is. This is like the best jollof rice I've ever had. And the fact that I'm starving. So... The goal for today is to hang up all my damn clothes. Mm, 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 These were a dollar ninety six at H E B. Like what? Spice. I don't like spicy food, but this turkey. Oh baby, it's worth it. Worth it. Mm, 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 mm. So, I'm going to hang up all of my clothes in the closet and then I'm going to vacuum and then baby, we are going to mop. Mop these damn floors. Period. Period, poo. So, that's the only thing I have on my agenda today. So yeah, we can get it popping. Mm-hmm. I'll bring y'all with me when it's time to clean. Okay, so I ordered these hangers. They're super sexy, but I didn't realize that pants can't fit through here. So I'm gonna have to return some of these and get the ones that can fit the pants. So that's a whole nother situation in itself. I'm gonna have to deal with. <clears throat> So for right now, I am just hanging up my dresses, my dresses or whatever. And yeah, I just have the dresses back here. But I think I'm actually gonna end up putting um, my coats back there. Because it's out the way. <clears throat> everything that can be hung up is actually not in this suit guys what is this stuff oh my god these are all of like my designer sunglasses 
I have to find a home for everything. Like, I really need another little bookshelf or something for a lot of stuff I have. <clears throat> like, I don't even know like where I'm gonna put like my sandals and stuff. For right now, I'm just gonna put stuff on the bookshelf because I'm about to mop the floor in a little bit. Shark boots. Mm. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to find out a solution for shoes because your girl just has too many. Too many. So I got everything out of the suitcase. Whew. I just need to find a place to put like my underwear and stuff for right now until I get this drawers, like this set of drawers I saw on Amazon. Nothing in here is permanent when it comes to placement because I just don't know where this stuff is gonna go. But for right now, it is where it is. Um yeah so i need to get a clothes basket too i just need organizers like to organize stuff because even right now like i need a jewelry organizer i need a lot of things <laughs> I be niggas, I you niggas, I I be you niggas, I you niggas, I be 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 you
last one I had. I'm over here reading these instructions, making sure I did this right. Because this is way different than the one I had before, okay? told me I have a big ass box from UPS and that means that's my jackets um so I want to go downstairs and get that it's raining here I sound stuffy per usual so today's agenda is to I have a lot of packages come in unbox stuff I need to go to Target and Home Goods. I have a very tight list of things I need because I need towels I didn't want to keep any of my old towels from Atlanta so yeah we need to go make a Target return, a Target pickup, and yeah, so let's get this beautiful day started, people. I'm already loving the light in my new apartment, like, 
lighting is amazing so yeah content about to be going crazy so i'll check back in with you all but yeah i gotta get shit done today more of my boxes are here and this has like all of my shoes well this is jackets other stuff these are all of my freaking shoes i'm so excited i'm so happy i have like supplies now like a little bit of stuff at least you know Maybe get my water bottle. anywhere for this stuff to go right now so yeah y'all it's raining bad i just got back from target and i went to home goods so yeah my target stuff was actually free because i had a 20 dollar gift card and then i made a return of something so and i still have like a dollar or something left on the gift card so i'm super excited about that so, yeah. How does this fill out in my bag on the bed? Okay. My phone. Purse is wet. And I have to still run back out to my hair. is crazy. All right. So, from Target, from Target, I got some Way Hand Soap. I absolutely Love this stuff. The three pack of Febreze um, plugins, some sponges, and then some downy free and gentle um, fabric softener. So that stuff is really, really good for me because I have sensitive skin. And I want to wash my duvet insert now that I have some fabric softener to keep everything all nice and tight. So that's what we're about to do. Oh shit, where the bleach goes. Look at me, fuck it up. Let me take this out. The only thing I really, 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 is that what I think it is? They didn't even clean this bitch out. <sighs> Lord help me, Father.
the little laundry thing was dirty as crap. So I'm just trying to like clean it out. Okay, this actually might be okay. Um, and then I can just get something else to put on the side or I can just sit the utensils there. But this should be fine actually, now that I think about it. So we'll hold on to the packaging just in case. <sighs> All right. The next thing I got from Home Goods were towels because I want to, I don't want to use white towels anymore because white towels just, they just don't be acting right. So I said I'm going to be using um, towels that are like, I want to do like a khaki color. All right. Time to go to the grocery store. Although I look crazy, my bodysuit ain't bodysuiting enough for me. It probably came up out of my damn underwear for all I know. But all right. This bag is to keep groceries cold. And then I'm also going to take, why well, do we need this one? Because, well, yeah, I can. I'll take that piece. Your girl just been stressed, okay? Stressed out. Truth is I'm tired. <clears throat> yeah, a bitch is tired. I'll be back. So, I just got back from H-E-B. I think I was in there for an hour. I spent $173, but I got so much stuff. My camera battery is about to die, and I'll show you all my stuff after I charge my battery, okay? All right, so my camera, ooh, my camera's charged. Yeah, it was raining all day, but now the sun wanna come out. But I went to H-E-B and I got some stuff for the fridge. It don't look like much, but it's a lot. Um, so, got some alkaline waters. I had this already, I had this already. They have this rotisserie lemon pepper chicken. I got some turkey bacon, shrimp. Y'all, this whole filet of salmon was $20. It's kind of blurry, but whatever. Vegetables, produce, fruit, some chicken wings, this little pizza. I gotta go to Trader Joe's to get more stuff. But y'all, I have not been able to find the Country Crock plant-based butter with the avocado oil in so long, and they had the sticks. H-E-B's um, ranch is so good. I got a green juice. And my mom told me to put my bread in the refrigerator. Okay, then I also got these muffins, which I'm about to eat. I just ate some of that rotisserie chicken with the salad. Um, nope. Then in here, I got just some little snacks. Um, re -ups. They even had the Nando's sauce. Like, what? Little baby mayonnaise, which I thought was so cute. Why is it so blurry? Um, just got some packs of noodles. Y'all, they had lychee mart. They had, I'm about to say lychee martini. They had lychee at the grocery store. I cannot believe it. I wanted to try this carbone roasted garlic sauce. I got peanut butter. I try to buy as much organic stuff as possible. And then this cute little lemon juice was only 99 cents. But yeah, I think for my pantry, I'm going to eventually end up doing like these cute little wicker baskets. But because I have so many of my clear baskets, I was like, you know, I need to use them. So I have an Amazon order that's here. 
some of, I ordered two things from Amazon and for some reason they canceled my fucking Amazon order. Like I ordered some, like the little, the plugins for the Febreze and I ordered this um, silicone toilet, toilet brush cleanser. So yeah, I'm very annoyed with that. To order bar stools. I don't know what I'm waiting on, honestly, but whatever. Whatever. But my knives will be here. My knife set will be here tomorrow. My um cooking utensils and something else I order will be here tomorrow. I need to get forks, plates all that stuff so I can really cook. And a few other things I need like cutting boards, um, what else? A strainer, some mixing bowls, and then I also wanna do glass. Like I wanna do glass food storage containers, but I just don't wanna go like crazy on Amazon buying stuff right now. I'm just like, damn, why ain't nobody got me, give me no Amazon gift cards? I mean, this move has cost me a lot. But I literally was starting over for a reason. So yeah, I started the fuck over. I love this butter so much. I'm about to put this on my, on my muffin and I'm gonna put it in the microwave. But I'm so excited because you can never find the avocado oil one. My greedy ass gonna eat a bite now. Put that in the microwave for 10 seconds. That's it. I'm so tired. I am, I just got a package from Amy and I checked my mailbox for the first time. first this is the only stuff I use on my cooch on my vajay this is the best the best vaginal sensitive foam soap it will be linked get you some of this okay Oh, these are the microfiber cloths I ordered so we can clean, baby. I got a 12 pizzy, 12 pack. Mm -hmm. Nice and clean. Nice and clean. Keep it clean around this motherfucker. And lastly, this is the really, really, really long. Um, this is the bathroom rug that I ordered. I had the white one when I lived in Atlanta and I loved it so much. I ordered it in this color. Let's see. It's super long. I just don't want to cut it. Let 
Let's go in the bathroom so we can test it out together. Okay. I don't know. I all right, close the shower door first of all. Let's kind of put this down on the ground. different yeah I still need something for shower <sighs> I don't know if I like this color I don't like this color I thought I was gonna go for like all these tans and stuff, but it just clashes with the, see these are my towels. Let me see something. I think it clashes. Yeah, it's going back. We're just gonna do white again. I do not like this at all. Yeah, that's going the fuck back. Didn't like that. It's a little bit later, and I'm in the kitchen using the oven for the first time. It's like, I need to order stuff. Someone Amazon just like looking at all the things that I wanna order. I'm about to make this pizza from H-E-B. It's like a little flatbread. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Another thing, I wanted to count my spices to see exactly how many I need to order. Spices, to be honest with you. So I like some of the jars that I've seen, but I didn't like the labels because I want the labels to be very minimal. But um, I have all right. This is already twenty-one spices. These, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna put these in here because these have to be, these have a grinder, so they have to be, you know, so those will stay. So 21. I have 32, 32. Now. 
We ain't doing none of that. My Amazon cart is my obsession. Like I just research shit on Amazon all the time. It's sick. Sick, you hear me? Good morning, Las Babes. It's Wednesday, October 4th. And your girl, your girl been waking up early because my body is still on east coast time so yeah but i got up at like 9 30 which really on the east coast it's like 10 30. so just handling some clerical things but having some issues with some paypal i mean with some amazon packages amazon like canceled one of my orders um yeah then i have some amazon returns i need to do as i showed you all i did not like that rug and i, re I need to return um a set of those hangers to get hangers that can fit my um for hangers that can fit my like my pants and my skirts and things like that so just about to generate a label from paypal because shop me is closet is back open it's not too many items i'm still going through stuff to add items back to the store but somebody bought a wig so i need to get that shipped um I hate that I do not have a P.O. box. So I need to find a post office that is close to me so I can get a P.O. box. So it looks like this is the one that's close to me. Okay. Yeah. All right. So this is a post office that I will first be going to to open up a P.O. box. Wow. I'm excited because I definitely need that. Um, oh yeah, there's one more thing I need to check on. Walmart had a sale on this air fryer that I wanted and um, yeah, because you know, Amazon Prime deals are about to come is starting like on the 10th and the 11th but baby there are some things that i really need that um i've been seeing and i just don't want to miss out on certain things because i try to wait until it was on sale for amazon but walmart has this air fryer on sale for 60 dollars, and on amazon it's 90. it's that drew barrymore um 
wait the toaster is 62 but on walmart it was let me check child let me check yeah the air fryer is 69 dollars on sale and i can get it today the toaster is 39 and on amazon it's 62 why child we buying both of these why is it so much money on amazon i'm just gonna try to make sure it's the same toaster okay let me show y'all all right so this is the toaster it slices two pieces of bread walmart the toaster 39.96 chow i'm buying both of these so basically the price i'm paying for this toaster and for the um the air fryer is like cheaper than what i would pay for the air fryer on amazon Yeah, they tripping. So I'm waiting for Lyft. I just signed up for like Lyft Pink or whatever. So I guess that gives me like priority pickups and all that shit. I was gonna take you all with me, but. <laughs> it's a package. I was gonna take y'all with me, but I'm just overwhelmed with the amount of stuff that I need to do. Um, I'm going to Whole Foods to do a return. And then I also want to get an item from Whole Foods that I need. And then I want to go to Trader Joe's. He'll be here in seven minutes. That's not really a priority pickup, but okay. Like, I feel so much more accomplished now that I went to Trader Joe's. Um, because there's just certain things I can't get that I'm just... You know that I've just become so accustomed to like having and eating and all of that good stuff so i just realized that i want to get a mount to go inside the cabinet door for my paper towels so let's do a trader joe's haul and y'all i have to get another tripod because we are sitting down so low but we're in the new kitchen okay i got one item from whole foods but this is the bag that my granny gave me that holds cold items and i just wanted to get an assortment of a lot of stuff so i don't have to always go back to the grocery store okay so first things first, I got the vanilla overnight oats. I love these. Some pesto, organic heavy whipping cream. I couldn't find the dairy-free one I wanted from Whole Foods. I mean from, from um, actually, you know what? It would have been at Whole Foods. I didn't check at H-E-B though, but um, we're gonna put things away as well. I got some hash browns because why not? Turkey meatballs why not again some fries i ordered an air fryer so my air fryer will be here soon so i'll be able to do that and look what i got y'all my spicy rice cake Ew. <laughs> i love those things then i got two of the steamed chicken dumplings this easy quick stuff What else this is what i got from whole foods this is the oat milk vanilla um okay let me start over this is the barista blend oat milk that i use to make my matchas but they have it in vanilla so i want to try this out because i may not have to um you know buy the, the vanilla pumps all right these are these little pancakes that i absolutely love so we got those 
my favorite pizza in the whole world. Got that. What else? Oh yeah, and the Brussels sprouts. Okay, so that's everything from the cold items that need to go away. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna be organizing stuff in this kitchen, but we just gonna do what we do for now. Okay, so that's all the cold stuff. Let's put all of that away. And then I just put this bag up here for now because, well, actually, wait, because I don't know where it's gonna go. Now let me get the big hefty bug, the hefty, the hefty bag. We're gonna come over here to the pantry because this is the pantry section. I want to make nachos. These are the best, best, best tortilla chips. So this is like my pantry right here. I'll be storing all of my food stuffs up in here. Yeah. Got chips. Dark chocolate pretzels. I know I love some snacks. <laughs> some sniggity snacks. I'm gonna need this one too, probably. For I thought I had two of these. Okay, maybe I just have one. So I want to put all of my oils and stuff in there. This is just some broccoli. This actually needs to go in the refrigerator. Y'all know I had to get my little pita chips. Corn tortillas, ground chicken, ground chicken and ground turkey. Definitely using both fruits. I'm gonna freeze one of them. Extra virgin olive oil. You know you gotta have your oils and you know all the condiments, all that stuff. I am so slow. I've already bought peanut butter. I was supposed to get jelly. <sighs> Soy sauce, olive oil spray, a must. If you know, baby, you know. Parmesan cheese. I'm about to clean all my fruits and veggies in a little bit. Fried onions. Honey, organic honey. Jasmine rice, the frozen ones, and then the Spanish rice. I love these little almonds things. I'm just keep them in here for now. I feel like that needs to go in a bigger container, but we'll see. All right, I got some salsa verde. Cane sugar, brown sugar. I don't know how I'm going to organize that yet, but have it whenever it's time to do so. Um, minced garlic, the fur cocky. I already have this, but I just wanted another one. You just never have too many of things. Chili crunch oil, for sure. 
And then I got another freaking peanut butter. I'm gonna just take the one back from H-E-B and keep this one. Syrup, gotta have your syrup. And then some chicken broth. A shiggity, a shiggity show. There's really no proper organization in here, but um, you know. I think it kind of looks good for right now. What do you think? It's just because these are so deep, like they go all the way back. I could probably just put like overstock in the back, but for now, I think this looks pretty good. I'm very happy with what I did. I don't know what I'm gonna cook tonight, but yeah. I wanna make like a little tea station. Like I wanna put like my tea stuff down here. And then I also have to have a place for my appliances because I don't really have that much countertop space except for right here. Like the only things I'm gonna end up putting on the countertop is like my knives and maybe like my electric kettle. But like my air fryer, my toaster, I don't think I want those things to be out. So like I said, I have a lot of cabinet space, which is I think is why this apartment did that. Um, so, yeah. So I think probably this will be like the storage area for all of my like big appliances and stuff like that. And then I also have space up here. Oh, that's my medicines. Um, so yeah, your girl has a lot of space. All right. I have hella, 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 hella packages downstairs. So I'm about to go get those things and then we will commence okay so i i just got my last box in the mail of my stuff from atlanta because y'all i wanted to keep my hermes box because i have like other things in here that i keep you know just certain little things and then the gift from my my Swarovski gift so yeah i'm keeping these things for sure. Where that wallet is it? And then I have like all my ribbons and stuff. So, all of that is here now. Perfect. What a day this has been. So, your girl went to have hookah but really to do work. Um, a friend had invited me to this place called La Pasha. I absolutely love that place. They have, place, <laughs> they have the best hookah and the best lemon mint slushie. And then I had got some food, which I'm about to heat up. But I went there to work on my vlog. I was in traffic for an hour and 11 minutes um, trying to get to the destination that normally ain't that far. I got the shawarma fries. But while I was in the Uber, I was exporting. Mm, mm, I was exporting all the content from the vlog. Let me warm this up. to the vlog I was there for probably about like two and a half three hours we were both working on our computers he was working I was working y'all tell me why I closed out I closed out Final Cut Pro and I go back none of my edits were there I was pissed sick so I get home and I'm like you know I can't sleep like I just I have to you know I have to redo it so I went to the conference room in our um, building in my building and basically edited the vlog all over again then I was trying to figure out where my Amazon package was whoa that was a close call I was trying to figure out where my Amazon package was and it was 
just sitting at the like the leasing office area. But I really wanted this to come because this is like my knives and stuff. And also the kitchen utensils, like the stuff to cook with. I still haven't ordered silverware and all that. I'm kind of waiting until next week because next Tuesday and Wednesday is Amazon Prime Day. And I know it's gonna be some good stuff. So, mm -hmm. I got these really cute silicone cooking utensils. I got my knife set that matches my pots and pans. And then this baby. This is this huge silicone, I mean, acrylic cutting board. I'm so excited for this. <clears throat> They're probably gonna do a big ass Amazon haul after Prime Day is over. But look at this. It goes on your countertop. So. This is perfect, oh my God. So when it's time to cut your stuff, see it just fits right there and you cut. Love this. This is so cool. I wonder if it's dishwasher safe. Cause I definitely wanna put it in the dishwasher. I'm a dishwasher girl, if y'all ain't know. But yeah, all my silverware, I mean the knives and stuff, is definitely about to go in this dishwasher. But of course, in true Mia fashion, my camera is dying, so I will see you lovelies tomorrow. Don't know what we're doing tomorrow, but it's gonna be something productive for this apartment. Bye. Good morning. I feel I don't know, but um, y'all, it just rains and rains and rains. And I thought today was Friday. It's only Thursday. Like, whack. <sighs> My body wakes up at the same time every day. I wake up at 10 a.m. automatically. I'm just eating a little blueberry muffin um, and some orange juice. Mm -mm -mm. I need to get my paper towels out. Hold on. paper towel holic I don't know why I'm like this but um yeah it's a very rainy day I'm actually just gonna work from my bed right now um so yeah oh yeah before my camera died last night I was unboxing my new knife set I love the knife set. Let me show y'all. The knives are super cute. The same brand as my pots and pans. Absolutely love them. Love, love, love. You know, your girl be cooking and stuff. So I put them in the dishwasher, but. And honestly, when it comes to knives, how they give you like all these little steak knives or whatever. Child, I don't be using these, but I just think they're so cute. And that's where those sit. Now, another item I ordered that is going the fuck back. 
is these. These do not match the web description at all. It said they were khaki. Child, this is not khaki. And then I started doing reviews on utensils that have wooden handles. They say that you can't put them in the dishwasher. So, this is more like a gray to me. What do y'all think? This is more of a gray. Now, we're gonna compare it to This is the one I got from Karot. This is this one. They are very similar in the top portion, but yeah, I don't like how dark the handle is because I want it to, you know, match the rest of my stuff. So these are going back. But yeah, they were saying that um, you really can't put these in the dishwasher, so I'm just like, <sighs> Yeah, I don't like how dark the handles are at all. And I'm sad because they're nice, but they're just, I don't like them. So that will be an Amazon return today. Some Amazon packages that I'm waiting for today are my other hangers so I can hang up like pants and skirts and all that in my closet. What else? Amazon accidentally sent me a replacement for the bathroom rug. So I have to return that to get my money back. Oh yeah. And my toaster and air fryer are coming. Child, I can't wait. So, it's early. I'm about to get back in the bed and just do some work from the bed. Work on getting this vlog up. So, I'll follow with y'all later. That was fast. I actually like Walmart because they will deliver your stuff the next day. So this is my new toaster. I think it's gonna go very well with the aesthetic of my place. Let's see what she's giving. Make something beautiful. Oh, she real cute. She is really cute. Okay. Loving this for me. It looks really good in my kitchen. It matches, like, just matches all the aesthetics and the vibes. Absolutely love this for me. All right. Appliance number two. The massive air fryer. Okay, we back in the game. The girl got an air fryer. I'm so happy I caught this on sale yesterday. Like. <laughs>
and Walmart texted me and was like, the driver's on the way. She'll be there by 10.22. I was like, wait a minute, it's 10.20. And then I got a text in that was there and she took a picture. It was sitting outside my door. So shout out to me. Oh my eye. Let me keep this book. Because that shows you how to cook certain things in the air fryer. Wow. She's a massive one, but she cute. It is so freaking cute. Oh my gosh. OMG. Like, why is it so cute? It's super, super cute. the big one. This one looks so much easier to clean too, but yeah. good what's up it's much later it is 5 30 p.m i just combed my hair for the first time i'm wearing hats because i have a loose track and it just looks fucking crazy my leave out looks crazy and i just don't want to embarrass myself like that but um i'm about to take my trash to the little trash chute and then i don't know maybe go walk around outside and get like a matcha or something i don't fucking know y'all like i don't know what i'm really doing anymore I'm just out here living life and just trying to survive. So I guess I'll bring my camera with me so you all can see what's going on. But um, yeah, y'all seen this outfit plenty of times and I realized that I need more chill clothing where I can still look put together, but I'm sorry, I'm in my athleisure bag and this is all I ever wanna wear. So, but at least I look cute. I have on like my little Dior's. I just have on this hat. At least I put on earrings today, so. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Good morning, happy Friday. It is October 6th, ciao. And I'm about to go to the nail salon. Yes, I look like yesterday, but I actually ended up not even going anywhere to wear this outfit I had changed. But I'm about to try out a new nail salon that some people recommend it and it's very close to me so i'm happy about that i'm not gonna bring my camera because i'm new to this you know this nail salon new to this area i just want to kind of get acclimated just make sure that this you know the environment is cool before i start whipping out my camera i'm super excited though i'm about to go ahead and call lift and get these nails done, get my crusty ass toes done because chow, it's the weekend and your girl needs to feel like herself. I'm tired of wearing this hat. So I'll be vlogging from my phone and you all will see me later. All right, y'all, I came back from the nail salon. Got white, they look good. This is the best pedicure I ever had for my had in my life. My total was $107 for a fill-in and for a pedicure with gel polish and um, 
yeah but the pedicure they put like normally i don't like getting normally i don't like getting my legs massaged but because i was moving and my the bottom of my feet were just hard and crusty but they i got like the lavender massage oh the place i went to is called milano nails um in the heights it's fucking huge the nail salon it has like a capacity of like 100 people the place is huge okay but they use like real lemons massage my feet with like the lavender scrub got a seven minute massage like baby it was chef's kiss but um right now i am just cutting up i cut up this salmon that i had because i needed to get it out the fridge so i can put it in the freezer i'm about to go to lunch with a new friend she's actually a friend of a friend of a friend who lives in houston so she said she can help me she's going to take me to run some errands which i thought was very sweet but i just want to get some seasoning on my salmon this is what i use tony's magic salmon seasoning a1 in the cooking they like to bag them up and I just put them in the freezer so I can cook these later this was six pieces of salmon for $20 that's great So the rest of my cooking utensils will be here tomorrow. I'm excited about that so I can really get busy in this kitchen. I need to also buy more cutting boards. Like I wanna have a designated cutting board I use like just for fish or you know just for like certain things just for contamination purposes because i clearly just cut fish on this you gotta disinfect this baby but i'm loving my new apartment i love the space i have i love how much beautiful lighting i have um i can't wait to really start creating content in here I'm starting to, you know, just get all the things that I need. I'm super excited because last night I ordered like a, the rest of the stuff to kind of finalize just things I need for like kitchen utensils wise. And I also ordered my bar tools. So I'm very happy about that. I'm gonna leave one piece of salmon out because I might make some later. I was gonna make some tacos or something, but I'll just put that there. Put this one in the fridge. Okay. <coughs> My bar stools are supposed to come between the six, the twelfth or the seventeenth. They are so freaking pretty. And the guy who put my bed together on Task Rabbit, I got his number. So he was just like, hey, you know, I can put, you know, I do basically put anything together. So I'm probably going to use him again in the future to help with that. Alright, so I'll be right back. I am so excited. 
because my other black hangers came and now I can really hang up the stuff I need in my closet. Yes. So we about to um, get to work in the closet real quick and hanging up the right stuff. Super sexy, super sleek. <laughs> much later I actually just woke up maybe like 25 minutes ago I had an awesome evening Whew. shout out to Bev and shout out to my girl Brie back in ATL with the link um, Bev was so sweet and we went to this taco place that we found off of Google and the taco place is called taco fuego we thought it was just like you know a standalone taco place turns out it was in this amazing food hall called Post Hall. And the food hall had so many delicious options. Um, we also got food from this West African fusion restaurant. Whew, excuse me, called Chopping Block. And I got it to go. But baby, the tacos were amazing. I ended up getting... Um, two chicken and a shrimp burrito taco with the consomme. Baby, it was so good. And then they had a bar. We sat in the bar. You know, you guys saw the footage. But it was a fun afternoon. I had my first lemon drop in Houston. And yeah, I'm definitely going back. A great place to vlog, get some amazing content. A unique, fun date. Sorry, y'all. I'm like indigested. I have indigestion. I need to learn to stop eating my food quick like that. Oh, it's still sitting in the kitchen. But um, trying to debate if I'm going to go out and just probably put on like a cute hat or something, or if I'm just gonna go to sleep and wait for tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know what kind of vibes I'm on right now. I kind of feel like I should wait till tomorrow. <sighs> part of me, ooh. A part of me feels like I should go out today. I don't know. But just wanted to check in with you all. The next time we probably chat, I will be getting my hair done at 2 p.m. by Ange Slays. So, good night.